Hello and welcome to this training tutorial on the Spire Electrics Retro Series R10 light. In the last video, we looked at getting your site ready for installation, and now that we've done that, we're ready to get stuck into it, starting with fitting off your new Quick Connect plug. To begin, make sure your power is turned off and your 12 volt transformer is fitted. If you're unsure about this, check out our first video in this series for more information. Begin by cutting the cable to the existing light, ensuring there's enough extra cable available for future servicing. Using a pair of cable strippers or pliers, cut back the outer sheath 30 millimeters or one and 3 16 of an inch. Remove 9 30 seconds or 7 millimetres of insulation to reveal the copper. Twist the wires firmly to ensure they're ready to go into the terminal connector. Next, place the connector collar over the cable, ensuring that the tab is facing towards the light. Then place the gland nut over the cable. Now the Retro Series light is supplied with three different size cable glands. To select the cable gland, simply place it over the cable, ensuring a nice firm fit without too much bulging. Slide the cable gland down the cable and out of the way, and then install the connector barrel. Next, Grab the terminal connector and with the screwdriver provided, loosen the terminal screws to allow you to fit the wires. Once the screws are loose, place the wires into the terminals and tighten the terminal screw firmly by hand. Next, slide the connector barrel up to the terminal connector and thread on, being carefully not to cross thread. Once it's threaded, ensure it's firmly tightened by hand. Slide the cable gland into the connector, ensuring that it sits flush. Next, Slide the gland nut into position, threading onto the connector collar and tightening firmly by hand. Now, undo the two filler screws on the base of the connector and remove them completely to allow us to install the lanolin. Open the lanolin tube and inject the lanolin into one filler hole until it becomes visible out of the second hole. Ensure the O-rings remain in place and return the screws to the connector. Tighten each screw firmly by hand before continuing. Lastly, slide the connector collar over the plug until you hear two distinct clicks. Your Quick Connect plug is now fully installed, but keep watching the other videos in our series to see just how easy it is to install your Retro Series R10 light. Thanks for watching.